If you still want to pick a poinsettia to complete your holiday decor, here's your chance. Mm -hmm. Allison's at a big poinsettia sale in Denmark this morning. Hi, Allison. Where is she? We can't even see her. She's hiding. Hey. Oh, <laughs> tricky stuff, huh? <laughs> no, I, uh, maybe you can't pick out the right color you want or the perfect color, so you pick all three oh, in one plant. Love it. Love that, huh? Three we have one of these one. in our lobby right now at Fox 11. They're absolutely beautiful. It's heavy, though. I'm going to set it down. <laughs> this is the area of floral plant growers where Hundreds of people are going to be walking through today buying their poinsettias, 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 either one. They're both here. And uh, it's the annual uh, sale for the Denmark Lions Club, and we're with Dean Kalepka. Good morning. Good morning. 35th annual. Yes, it is. So it's been a long tradition. Yeah, so you guys have it down to a science now, huh? We think we've got it pretty well down. Uh, mm -hmm. We've uh, been able to do it every year, and uh, it, it uh, flows pretty smoothly. Yeah, so new this year, though, is one of these arrangements you have that you're holding. Right. Uh, we try and do something new every year and work with the greenhouse to come up with something new. Mm -hmm. uh, this year we have a planter with a poinsettia in the center, but then accented by the euphorbia, which looks like snowflakes. It's beautiful. So uh, people can come out and, and pick this up here at the sale today. Yeah, and so the, some of the proceeds from the event actually help the Lions. Why don't you tell us what you guys do? Well, this is one of our four major fundraisers throughout the year, and uh, we take the proceeds and we... we look to benefit the community and that's what we're here to do to serve mm -hmm. the community uh, we work with youth groups little league boy scouts and and contribute money to help them as well as uh, the needy in the community food baskets people in need if they have a disaster and mm -hmm. things like that so uh, we try and keep the money in the community as well as uh, other lions uh, needs like uh, eye, eye care and also the lions camp in Rochelle for uh, blind and yeah. uh, and kids in need. And along with all those great causes, this is neat because you're buying a poinsettia that's coming straight from the greenhouse. We are in the greenhouse right now, and then you guys bag them up and you take them home. Right. They'll never be able to buy a fresher poinsettia than mm -hmm. what they get here today. Um, they're walking in the greenhouse and be able to get it right here. Mm -hmm. And then what we'll do, if you'll hold this. Okay. Um, when they How come are you in, holding this for so long? This is heavy. I'm putting it down. Uh, what we'll do is we, we take them from the greenhouse and we yes. will bag them up for the, for the people mm -hmm. and uh, they could take it home. There we go. Thank you very much. So again, a great cause out here uh, about five and a half miles east of Denmark. Correct. And 9.30 to 3.30 today? 9.30 to 3.30 and Santa comes at 10, so he's uh, guaranteed to be here. Great. Thank you so much. You're welcome. So a great event, you guys, if you still need to pick up your poinsettias and just to really lift your mood, actually, walking through all of these, these plants out here east of Denmark. Yeah. So we'll see you guys later. Hey, Allison, real quick, uh, how much are the poinsettia yeah. plants? Oh, you know, we have a, uh, right over here, it varies by the size, but the one I'm holding is, uh, they range, what the prices range. Anywhere from place, three, right? three dollars, six dollars, mm -hmm. sixteen up to twenty-five. Okay. Yeah, so all price ranges, and uh, yeah, just keep them watered, and you'll keep them alive. Yeah, we and promise. money, money goes to to a good cause too. So absolutely great. Thanks, Allison. Sure.